Hey, what in the world is happening with Vashon Real Estate? Well, let's check it out. <laughs> Okay, here we go. All right, so um, here's the deal with Vashon. All right, I will never get over how weird Vashon is. It's always pretty much the opposite of what's happening anywhere else. Um, in the areas around the counties, the county level research that I've done around Vashon is doesn't look like this. There's more buyers than sellers, right? This is this, what you're looking at is last three years of supply and demand green is supply number of houses that come to market blue is demand number of homes that went under contract um and in the surrounding counties in king county in general there were more houses that went under contract that came to market but not so on Vashon. and you know this is you know just weird i mean Vashon's weird i love it that's why i live here because it's weird um but what you're and in November, there's significantly less than there were last November. Last, this is going to be last November. Yeah, there's about half the number of listings that came to market, half the number of buyers than last year, right? This is like December, right? This is December of 2022. Again, more in 2022 than there were this year. I would suspect that we're going to see even less this December, right? So if you're looking to sell on Vashon, it's a little bit of a crapshoot because the buyers tend to go away. That's this, that would be this trend. Um, and uh, if you're looking to buy, there's just a ton of available inventory. You should be able to negotiate a decent price on Vashon given the number of houses that are available over here. Now, look, every house is different. Every neighborhood is different. Everything is unique, especially on Vashon. So while this information is directional, it's not necessarily instructive, meaning the environment in which you're buying or selling is one where there's more inventory than there are buyers. But you may have a unique situation, a unique house. There's way less of those kinds of houses or whatever. Your, your situation is undoubtedly unique. So you need to know what the environment is so that you know how to plan for your unique situation. And that's what I'm here for. Um, the other word of advice that I would give is go watch the King County update. Although the specifics to the market are different here, um, there's important macro information that is useful for Vashon buying and selling. It's the overall context in which the economy lives in uh, is discussed on the King County update. And I'll take you five minutes to watch that. Um, and give you a, a, a better grounding in what's to be expected here. But for now, if you're not going to do that for now, I would say if you're listing it, I would make sure that you were priced strategically. And if you were buying, I'd make, I, I'd get out there and look at everything that was already out there. Cause there's a ton of leftover inventory from the year. There just hasn't been the buyer demand to suck it up yet. So you should be able to find something that works for you. That hasn't been available the case for the last few years. So, if you got questions or anything you need, let me know. That's what I'm here for. If I don't talk to you before New Year's, happy New Year to you and your family. And I look forward to working with you in 2025. Let me know what I can do for you. Aaron Hendon with Christine and Company over to EXP Realty. Talk to you later.